we developed the use of radioisotopes to devalue rhino horn. So you were using radioactive material, small quantities of it inserted into the horn of a rhino, which is like then putting a massive bright light into the horn that no one can turn off. It stays there and as it goes across borders, the detectors are in place that can pick it up. And it's then, you know, because, as we said earlier, you know, um, those detectors have been installed for other reasons, but just as capable of picking up the rhino horn as they are smuggled nuclear material. The situation is, in South Africa, if you're caught in possession of radioactive material, it's defined as a crime against the state. So theoretically, it can open up the possibility of a person being charged with you know, that sort of offence as well as wildlife trafficking offences. So you're just kind of ramping up the the, the reward risk ratio in the favour of us.